Ladies and gentlemen, the challenger, Tommy Gospodar from Odessa, Ukraine, Vasily Lomo Lomachenko. And across the ring, fighting out of the red corner, with his trainer, Carlos Linares, promoted by Taken Promotions and Golden Boy Promotions, wearing black with gold, and officially weighing in at 134.6 pounds. An outstanding professional record, consisting of 44 victories, including 27 big wins by knockout, only three defeats, undefeated for five years, from Barrenas, Venezuela, former featherweight, former super featherweight world champion, the reigning and defending WBA Ring Magazine lightweight champion of the world, Jorge El Nino de Oro, Linari. Now it was time to see who's the best fighter in the world is now. Linares and Lomachenko, round number one for the lightweight title. I want you guys to take your eyes to Loma's front foot, that lead foot. He always tries to get that front foot outside his opponent. Absolutely critical for a southpaw so that they have the advantage to shoot that straight left hand. There it comes with it as he fires it for the first time. He gets that head off the line. Look, just like there. He gets that head off the line. Off the line. That's the firing range there. That's what he does well. He always positions his, bo positions his body out of the firing range. That firing lane, that range. Loma where you can be in. hit. Loma came in, tried to place a left hand to the body, and there was a little return fire with a right hand from Linares. Number one thing as it pertains to range, Norris has a three and a half inch advantage. I'd like to keep this on the outside. You can see across the shoulders as well in that muscular back of Linares. He's just naturally the bigger man. And then you rehydrate after the weigh-in yesterday, and it's so noticeable. Round number six of this title fight. Linares came back with a little low one of his own. He is coming going a little bit low. Near the belt line. I'll tell you, you can start to see swelling, especially around the left eye of Jorge Linares. Discoloration around both, but swelling around the eye. We'll watch for that. Good combination from Linares as he landed a left hand. Now remember, he had the warning earlier. Another warning here from Ricky Gonzalez. One more, and it could be a point deduction. Quick feet get around you with shots. But he talks about music, about beats. And when he says, I can feel them discouraged, they're playing to my music. Yeah, he's... Good work from Linares. Much of that blocked, but still offensive output. And look at Loma, stepping right to him, landed a left uppercut, and then an overhand right at short distance from only a few inches away. <laughs> Nearly caught him coming in with a left hand, did Linares. <laughs> Great ability to get away and land a punch of his own. See ya. I think that the template was cut years ago with Manny Pacquiao. If I told you, you'd say, Oh! Linares caught him! Lomachenko goes down! What a turn! Seven. Hey, you okay? Step over here. And now, how will Loma react? You never know what's gonna happen. Great right hand. A right hand from Linares floors the pound for pound best. Here it is. Here it is. Loma walking straight in. 
getting real overconfident, got clipped with the right hand as he came in. When you come straight down the middle, the firing range, guess what? Lynn Norris met him with the right hand, right on the button. That's the South Paul killer, straight right hand. Boom, right on the chin. Vasily Lomachenko never knocked down as a pro as Oscar De La Hoya, the promoter.